Listen, I'm not here to tell you that it takes hard work to become great at something. You know that, you've been told that a million times before. Instead, I'm here to tell you a story about someone that loves the game more than you do. You see, he goes to the gym all the time and you've probably even seen him in there before. He watches you as you show up late, as you go half-assed in the workout, as you complain about how hard a workout is. But what do you care? He's not you. He's not even going to make the team. But he wishes he was you and he wishes that he even had that opportunity to make the team. But he doesn't. That car crash eight years ago took that opportunity away from him and now he's in a wheelchair. So how can you complain about how hard you have to work? How can you complain about how early you gotta wake up to get to a workout? There are people on this planet that don't have that opportunity to put in that work and to hit that weight room even though they dream about it every single night. So how can you skip a workout because you were up too late playing video games? Can you honestly say that you've done everything in your power to get better at this game? You can't. You see, you need to take a good look at yourself and then take a good look at someone who doesn't have that chance to run that suicide or to hit that weight room. You need to count your lucky stars because you were brought into this world with what you have. Whether it's more or less than the next man, it's more than somebody somewhere has. And you could easily be much worse off. But this isn't something to make you feel bad. This is a wake-up call. Life is about missing opportunities and capitalizing on opportunities. And you can't be afraid to fail. And if you do fail, at least you can look that same person in the eyes and tell them that you did everything in your power to achieve greatness. Don't talk about it, be about it.